Hey everybody, the Banga's back. Welcome to part 6 of Let's Play Spyro Attack of the Rhinox. Alright, we're still meandering our way through, like, Dragon Shores area again. Because we just, thanks to the Super Breath ability, we can actually advance to the other area. Which is really nice. And we actually picked up our first heart of the game, too. From defeating Ripto again. So, that's one heart, but we have another 11 to find. Rhinox is taking the bridge out to the kangaroo hoodoos. Wait, I'm pretty sure I can just ice breath my way through. But I'll do that later. Let's explore this hub. Awesome stuff. There are not places that I'm missing where I could have gotten key pieces earlier. Hi. This sucky gondola won't budge until someone powers it up. Well, find someone to power it up. I don't know, get yourself some batteries or something. Solar power gondola. I'm sure that's a thing out there. I don't see how this is my problem all of a sudden. Apparently it might be. Because that's how it be in these games. Okay, that's where I came from. There was another cave. I thought that was the same one. No, this is different. More banners. Gotta burn them. Cause that's what you gotta do. When you see a banner, you burn it. Well, if it isn't Spyro, Uncle Moneybags Mansion is just through that door. Oh. Is this mansion an actual stage? Or is this just a side area? I drowned through a corner? Really, game? And the thing is, I fell all the way through. Like, shouldn't it have been a bit shallow around that part? Hey, Spyro! Wow, what are you doing here? Hedrick asked us to find you. Sorry, kiddo, but it's time to go home now. Oh, alright. Check this out! I found it in this cave. You can have it. Bye! This is a long mechanical arm used for picking things up and manipulating them. It's a part of the machine we need to find for the fairy librarian. Of course. So we have only one more piece for this. That might get us our second heart, too. Okay, we're making progress still. Well, I suppose I can go to the mansion. The foyer. Is that considered its own level? It looks like it is. Oh my god, cat pillows. Hello, Spyro! Viewing my mansion will cost you 2,000 gems! Upkeep isn't free. Well, that's because you decided to charge that much. Marvelous! Just go right through that door there. Cookies! Milk and cookies! Ah, what's that thing? You're a dragon, Spyro! Do something! I think you can use those water fountains to short them out, Spyro. It's a water fountain. Help! Ah, oh, he moved. Okay, there we go. That's one. Ah, oh, so I have to lure him on top of the cat, then press the button. I got stuck on the rock, really? That did not count? There! D ha! This copper catastrophe is crushing my wallet! Get it off me! Hmm, I suppose I owe you. Ah, take this. It's worthless to me anyway. This dynamo is small in size, but can generate plenty of electricity. This gives you lightning wind ability! Okay, hold the B button to charge it up, then release it to unleash a storm. 
Lightning Wind ability. You don't suppose I could power up a gondola, right? I... I just came from there. Why would you tell me, hey, just go this way to find this location that you just came from? Thanks, video game. For saving me from myself. So you got the power, Spyro! Ride that sucker to the Cheetah Spot Spa! That's fine and all, but I think I want to explore the mansion again. Like, actually go... Shut up. Moneybags, your nephew sucks. Well, just say the Kool-Aid Man did it. The generator room. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay. So Rhinox have that ability. And I notice they constantly been able to eat me. But as long as I keep myself aligned away from them... Oh, I can probably dash away from them. There we go. Wait for them to get dizzy and then attack. But those guys are not dropping any gems. And they are invincible when they're doing that spin. Hold on, what are the totals here? There's 800 gems here, okay. And seven more items. So this may not be a small place after all. Then again, none of the areas seem to be small. This climbing pickaxe must belong to Bentley! It's huge! Alright, well, we got that. Let me use this breath for a little while. Rather than constantly switch. Oh, I'm back in the oasis? Oh, this is an upper reach. Ah, beautiful. Might be another wall yet before we can 100% a zone. Hope we can get the green key piece here. Rescue mission. Hey, it's Sergeant Bird. You're mistaken some good men, Sparks, and I'm gonna get him back. As you would. As you would, Sergeant Burb. Oh god. Now there's like newer enemies to deal with. I'm noticing that um Agent 9 would have one half. And then Sergeant Bird usually has the other half. So we might fill up the green key doing this. I hope. If we can, that'll be awesome. Because we're right next to a green chest. He's holding up the white flag as a sign of surrender. He's like, how dare you? You should be having more pride, you soldier. Hand you over to the tent. If you just want a nap. Alright, that's two. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 I just saw those shots coming. Shots are coming at me fast and furious like a spring break bar. Alright, that's three. I just gotta make sure I get all the gems, too. Honestly, they would take top priority. Is that what I wanna do? What the hell? What? Oh, I hit a spike, didn't I? Yeah, I think I hit the spikes. Yep, you can hit the missiles. I wasn't sure about it at first, but now that just confirms it. Is this a good idea? Well, there's less hostilities, so yeah. I guess it is. 
All right, you know what? Let's start going through all the upper area first. That way I don't miss any gems. And then just start working my way down. That's usually also my basic instructions for foreplay. But anyway, let's move on. Hey, she might wear gems too. <laughs> you don't know that. You know, all them rhinestones. You gotta look very glamorous. Oh, you're not looking glamorous. You need to go away. Anything else around this spot? No. Okay. Now we're just looping around. Yeah, the music is a bit catchy. Even if it does drag on. I don't think the bombs are really that useful. Unless you're firing at two different targets at once. Ow! I hit the spikes again. Wait, did I hit two things simultaneously? And because I was already hurt, I only took damage for the one? Oh, that's a warp! Oh, okay. Wound up losing the dude, though. So I'll have to find him again. And he shouldn't be far from the place. So this is just a warp and nothing more. You still have to go around the long way, it appears. Oh, psh. Okay. Well, I'm at half HP now. I gotta be a little bit more careful. There's two more guys. Ah, son of a... Oh, no. Oh, God. You were, like, right on the spikes. Oh, I'm in a critical condition now. I'm the one that's gonna need a first aid tent. Not you guys. Thank God it is exactly a full heal. Like, no matter how much damage you've taken. You know what? People that work the first aid tents are the real heroes. Especially your local doctors, your nurses, etc., etc. Yeah, well, I guess I should go more to the right. Hello! I think we might be on our way to finishing this. Okay, don't take that warp. Okay, now I gotta find one more guy. I don't think I've seen another cage, though. So this one I might be on the fence for. Let's just bring this one, and then we'll go on a big-ass search. Okay, one more, and then we're done. And if I hold all the way to the left? Maybe when you get to the button, go all the way to the right instead. I'm not really noticing if it's taking me anywhere different. Bet you this is a dead end. Yeah, it is. Okay. Where the hell is the last guy? Over here? Oh, there it is! Ah, okay. Wait, what if I take this warp? Oh, good thing I came back, because look. Awful lot of gems over here, including the blue one. 
All right, we did it, soldier. Time to get you home. Or someone else's home. Wherever you'd rather spend the night. Maybe your house sucks. <laughs> Ah, the last soldier! Take this key half, yes. Please let it be the green one. It is the green one! Alright, we can open green chests. It's a small stone tablet with writing on it. That's old. Let's keep it for now. Oh, guess we don't have the quest for it yet. That makes sense. Uh, I think there was an area to the southwest? Yeah, I think there was, see? We'll go to this place, the kangaroos. I don't know if we'll find Sheila. But who knows, we might find her. Kangaroo hoodoos at Outlook Region. Fantastic. Oh, we can get this one early too. Nice. That's one way to get across. Spyro! Great timing, mate! I need to get back home! Hey, timing is my middle name. Sorta. What's the problem? There used to be a bridge here, but someone's made off with the thing. Can you get me across the water? Little Ruble here is getting antsy. Uh, okay. Well, I almost fell in the water too. See, if you guys were a dragon, you could have done this. Wow, great job, Spiral. That'll do fine. They don't even have any animations or frames for when she jumps. It's just a standstill, like a still frame. Hey, thanks, Spyro. You're always a great help. Why don't you take this little glowy kangaroo carving? Ruble found it on the ground. This carving of a kangaroo glows with magical properties. This gives you butt slam ability, Spyro. Jump in the air, then press the L button to deliver a crushing blow. Why do I have a feeling I'm going to have to do that for something? Would I have needed to do that in past areas too? I don't know. I didn't notice anything that needed to be pounded. Ladies. <laughs> but yeah, at least we can open two different kinds of chests. So that's real boss. I wonder if there was an ability that allows you to jump higher. So I feel like it will cut around a lot of travel time. Now we're in the outback. That is Spyro! Rhinox to put 10 TVs throughout the resort! They only show pictures of Ripto. Imagine! Oh, propaganda. If you help out a mate and get rid of them for us, tourists will think we're a sham! You, you're next to water. No problem, Annie. I bet a butt slam will do just the trick. Okay, so that's why we needed that move. To smash televisions. That's what you came for. Oh my god, look at this statue. <coughs> you know, you're worrying so much about televisions, and yet there's this statue of Ripto. Oh, look, it's a shaman. Is that an enemy? It's not an enemy. Can you make any sense of this ancient writing on this rock? I tried for weeks. It says knock hedgehogs into statues. Er, yeah, I see what you mean. Like this? Oh, I need to charge. Strike. Huh, now we can use them to get around. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Now we got flying Rhinox. Those can be a bit of a nuisance. 
Can't smash those information kiosks. Which is fine. Information is valuable. Hi. Well, if it isn't Spyro, it's Box. At adventuring again? Sheila, we need to get the heart from your land to stop these horrible Rhinox. Those Rhinox took all our artifacts, so now we keep the heart in the museum. If you can find the artifacts and return to the museum, and I'll give you the heart. I'll do my best, Sheila. Oh, it did pick up a stone tablet. I wonder if that's what it's for. Oh yeah, the book we got much earlier is also part of it. Is that Pikachu blowing on a pipe? Or blowing on a useful instrument? Sometimes you just see it all. Okay. Could you just help me get up there, though? Would that have been too hard? Yes, it would have been. This hand drill looks well used. It's worn, but I can make out the initials MT engraved on it. Okay, Master Thief Tools. Got it. Alright, well, we're gonna put on some progress on that quest, too. Yeah, that, that hedgehog does look like Shaman from Pokemon. Have you noticed that? Okay, well there's the statue, and there's also the vault. I'm trying to scorch as many enemies as I can first. What the hell? Well there's the next area, but I don't want to go there yet. Not if I still got some TVs to slam. Welcome to the jam! Whoa, okay. Good thing I reacted to that bomb in time. Okay, there's the first button. Let's see if we can find the second one first before we start activating them. Anything. Oh, there it is. Let me activate this one first. Oh no! God damn it. Well, I better smash that statue in protest. Is there an easier way to move that stat, that hedgehog? No, I think it just goes back. Oh, okay, I see what I gotta do. Like that. So it'll only stand in one spot. And you gotta steer it just right. Bit of a stereotype throwing all these boomerangs all around, don't you agree? I'm just saying Australia's gone through enough as is. Then again, this game came out way before all of what's been going on with the fires. Just saying. <laughs> oh. Ah, even more TVs. Oh, I'll get the vault later. But for now, look at all these gems. Those disgraceful Rhinox have left our statues about. They look ready to fall apart. Perhaps bashing them will get rid of them? Oh, I guess I have to do it on top of the R. Those disgraceful Rhinox. Oh, yeah, I know. You already told me about this. As you watch me destroy one. Okay, put it over here. Aim it that way. And then go northwest again. Wait, did I get stuck? No, I didn't get stuck. Okay. 
It looks stuck to me. Oh, I see an item. There's a second last TV. A rare find indeed! This rose has an odor only a kangaroo could appreciate. Ah! That's one of Bianca's items. Fantastic. And there's yet another statue. Ripto really has no shame, does he? Like, pure egotism. It just reeks of egotism, I'm telling ya. And that's what villains do. They're total narcissists. That's all 10 TV, Spyro. Let's go tell Annie. And a minute. Ah, one of Bentley's gloves. Alright. Well, I guess I should deal with the vault now. Oh god, where was the first button again? I think it was around here. And then we just go around all this. And there we go. We'll just go in it now, and we'll tell Annie. Then we'll be about our merry way. God, it feels so weird just doing all these quests like bit by bit by bit. It's almost like how I approach Skyrim. There's a lava lamp! I can watch these things for hours! And we don't know who it belongs to. Yet. Ready then. Let's go find Annie. Suppose we just Suppose we just drown. And then we go find Annie. Nope, that's not Annie. Annie should actually be around here. Way to go, Spyro! Here's a bottle I found containing a powder scented like bananas. Fertilizer ingredients, of course. Alright, so I think that's enough work there for now. We'll do another quick escape. And then I think we go to Cheetah Spa? I think that's where we would go. Still one missing item in Dragon Shores, along with 60 gems. Fairy Library? May not be a bad idea to come back to that later. Yeti Serengeti, Bird, Bird Barracks, Team's Guild, Rabbit Habitat, Banana Savannah, Kangaroo Hoodoos, Moneybags Mansion only has 7%? Why only 7%? I—I I, I mean, I know I left it. But it didn't seem like much of an area. Unless I... There was like two other ways and I just picked the other one. Anyway, I think I might have to return there. In any case, let's stop here. And in the next part, we'll uh, make more progress. What's my overall percentage? 48. So all these episodes, you know, granted it's not even a lot. And over three hours of gameplay... We still only barely got half of all the gems for a total of 48 in-game percent. See you everyone, thanks for watching.